Thank you very much. Uh, good luck with your work. 
Ele ganha uma proposta. Amanda! Uh, I am the chairperson of the Electoral Commission. The name is Cindy Sompenyana. Uh, I have also my colleagues, some of them have gone to other provinces, but the ones who are here, we have a Reverend uh, Vukile Mehana. <laughs> Comrade Saida Kachelia, and we have uh, Makulu Lidwaba. <laughs> that is from the uh, commission itself. Oh, yes, of course. Super will kill me. Uh, Super Moloi. <laughs> That, that, is, that, that is our team from the uh, commission. As I say, other members have gone to other areas. Um, then we have support groups. One support group, or oh, maybe I should stand here. One support group is the administration, which is headed by um, Pandile Sizani. So with him, he's got other, other colleagues who are helping him in the administration. And then we have the agency, uh, which is, which always you will see whenever we have elections. It's called Election. And Nedisa uh, is dealing, heading that one with her team. Right, uh, we understand you have already been working the whole day. Uh, we don't want to make you more tired than you already are. And we suspect you also have got an interest in one area of our, of our work, which is <laughs> uh, the announcement of the consolidated uh, proposed uh, officials, particularly of the top six positions of our organization. Briefly, of course, the Electoral Commission was set up uh, in the ANC Constitution. Uh, it is uh, Rule 14. You will read that, uh, those details. And we also sent out uh, to all the provinces and even regions, uh, quoting from Rule 2517 of the Constitution, what are considered uh, actions of misconduct. So we were simply trying to bring to your attention that at this um, critical stage of, our, of the life of our movement, <coughs> Our people want to see some sign, some sign that the movement is doing something to get us back into the straight and narrow path. And so uh, we said, at the, we must restore the power of the branches. When we sing, we sing songs which say, Amanda, Asema Sebe, the power is in the branches, and then go on to ignore the branches. So we wanted to make sure that this time uh, the branches will feel that their power is, re is, is recognized and respected. That is why when the BGMs, the branch general meetings, met, a full record was made of their proceedings up to the nominations for various official positions. And photos were taken of the lists of attendance in those branch meetings. And there were three copies in the yellow book. 
one for the branch, one for the province, and one for the na national uh, leadership, in other words, the Chuli House. We, for the first time, bypassed the regions per se, in other words, the names were not taken to the regions. They went from the branches straight to the provinces and from the branches straight to the headquarters to reduce possible changes of what the branches had decided. And we hope that if the, the, as the election was going through trying to reconcile the branch document, the provincial document, and the national document of the branch meetings. The fact that there are no discrepancies shows that there has been no interference with what came from the branch by the time it gets to the province or by the time it gets to the national. So I'm saying there is your movement responding to the complaints that uh, the strength, the authority of the branch was being ignored by some officials at higher levels finding it necessary to make changes even without consulting those branches. So if we now say there's hardly been any complaint from the branches about the names which finally came out, it means the, the names remain as they were when you in the branches decided. Um, this is how we shall proceed quickly. Um, Bandile, on behalf of administration, is going to explain the role they have played in ensuring that um, the, the work is done efficiently and checks and balances are made to make sure that there is no reason for anybody to be unhappy. And then Nedisa, uh, on behalf of uh, the agency election, will then give us the proposed names of the top officials, our top six, proposed by you in your, in, in your branches and then consolidated so that the five regions, we're not throwing away the regions, we just didn't want them to interfere in the process, but we recognized them. The, the five regions had first been consolidated and then the final results are put together for all of them together. And this is what you will be getting. But let me call upon Mandile uh, take the next step. Thank you, Tata. Our comments are going to be very fast. As Tata has said that uh, we received the yellow books together with the agents and comrades, we have captured the names. If any branch, I want to emphasize, comrades, if any branch has got any query, we are not dealing with sub-regions or regions, any branch has a query, we have the information. And then we'll deal with the branch, not a spokesperson of a branch. So branch A in greater to one aspect, you have a problem with the, with the results of the nomination, come to us. There are boxes there, comrades, everything is covered. I think it has been emphasized, comrades, this is not a voting gathering. This is a gathering for consolidating nominations, not votes. It's nominations from branches. Anything that we are considering here, comrades, is a product of a branch, not a product of anything else. So if you have any challenges or any queries, questions, we are willing to entertain you and engage you, and we'll show you, comrades. But please don't ask us about branch Z when you are staying in branch B, because you have no understanding of what happens in branch Z. So stick to your own branch. 
The second thing is that what we have done, every name, we've got them in the, in the computer, as that I have said. We will show you the list. These are the votes per region. Then you'll be shown that by Unadisa. The, the third thing is that is important. Uh, Provincial Secretary will also explain to it, Comrades, that uh, the pre-registration is going to take place here. We are not anticipating or expecting any situation, Comrades, when it comes to registration, that uh, the branches have pronounced that who is their delegate for that branch. That mandate, Comrades, cannot be changed between Johannesburg and Irene. It changes. If there's any change, Comrades, of a delegate to the conference, we must have some kind of a confirmation from the branch. I cannot take Netisa with me and write a letter and say, now Netisa will be sick on the 16th. He has a sick note. <laughs> or else Netisa will be dead, but she's not going to die. <laughs> but it's important, Comrades, that we say the mandate is coming from a branch. If any change that must take place, it must have the blessing of a branch. No changes. We've got the delegates and their alternates. So registration is going to take in that place. We, are not, we don't want to spend more time complete notice. We will show you what the branches have said in terms of who are they nominating. So it's going to be there, comrades. You want to explain it now, or when we get to there. The first part, comrades, that we are going to say, we are going to focus on the top six. Top six. You will be given numbers for the top six. Remember, comrades, how tech as a province, in terms of additional members, it must come up with 250, that is the threshold, 250 names of people that are nominated. The 250 from Gauteng will be combined with 250 from all other provinces as well as the leagues, the Veterans League, the Youth League, and the Women's League. And then when they all combine at the national conference, we will have to have 250 in the ballot. So some of us comrades will be in the ballot, but will not get enough nominations. Don't think that comrades, your name has disappeared somewhere you did not get enough. So what we'll do, comrades, we'll go to the top six. That is, I will explain. Additional members, comrades, we are going to show you the 250. But if, comrades, for instance, when it comes to the 250, let's say from 245, we've got comrades who are getting one nomination, and all of them, there are about 40. We cannot choose one comrade will take the entire 40 of comrades who have received one nomination. So don't say, comrades, we said 250, we end up 270. It's because comrades have received equal number of nominations. Therefore, we cannot cut off 250 and leave other nominations outside. I think that is the process, comrade chair. Sisi. Yeah. <laughs> I just want to explain something when it comes to the additional numbers. We just received about 18 books, booklets. We had to quickly work through them. But unfortunately, for the additional members, we are not yet done. So the outcome that we are going to present. We exclude about 15 complaints that my colleagues are still working on. Therefore, that, especially complaints that are in the lower margins, are the ones that will be affected. But I'm saying the numbers that we're going to present today are not the final ones pending the addition of those 15 complaints there. So, Congress Secretary will keep in touch and hand over the final product once we have done. That aspect. Comrades, let me quickly, if you will allow me, because I need to work from my laptop here, I'll put it on here. You can't hear me. Oh, no, it's, 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 it's. 
for a poor Mashashule received three branches. Ombek Sengi of Duno was nominated by one branch. Comrade Balega Mbeche received one nomination. Comrade Naledi Pando received one nomination. Comrade Dave Mabuza received seven nominations. Comrade Mungula Mugonyan received two nominations. Comrade Ace Mahashule got three nominations. Comrade Manus Kikigaba received one nomination. Comrade Jewel Neshdenza received two nominations. Oh, okay. 
Prime Minister. Two nominations for Home Reform Ashanti. Eight nominations for Home Reform Ashanti. Two nominations for Home Reform Ashanti. One nomination for Home Reform Ashanti. One nomination for Home Reform Ashanti. One complete, one nomination for Mr. Comrade Ayaka Zondo. One nomination for Comrade Tipo Velasa. One nomination for Comrade Wisi Wamulele. One nomination for Comrade Ed Namulewa. Two nominations for Comrade Comrade Zolin Kisa. Two nominations for the name of Sissi Dolashe. One nomination for the name of Comrade uh, Dolashe. One nomination for Comrade Blaise Zimande. One nomination for Comrade Tito Moeni. One nomination for Comrade Rauka Kusi. There we have it, the African National Congress in uh, Gauteng has uh, made its intentions known and uh, they've uh, endorsed Cyril Ramaphosa to head the party in its elective conference on the 16th of December in about two weeks uh, from here. And just to give you a brief, uh, brief breakdown on uh, the nominations uh, that have been coming through, uh, Ramaphosa leads uh, the pack with 374 nominations, uh, followed by Nkosa Zanat Lamini Zuma with 64 nominations. And uh, coming uh, now as a deputy president, Linde Wesisudu leads the pack with 182 nominations, uh, closely followed by Zolim Kiza with 109 nominations and Nalid Dipando with 48 nominations as uh, the national chairperson. Uh, of course, uh, Gweda Mandashe is the preference of the ANC in Gauteng uh, to be the national chair of the party in uh, its elected conference in about two weeks' time. And uh, Secretary General Senzum Kunu leads with uh, 341 nominations, uh, followed by Ace Mahashule with uh, 68 nominations and Figi Mbalula with seven nominations. And uh, as Treasurer General of the party, Mashatile has got the nod with 384 nominations. Mashatile is currently the uh, ANC uh, national chairperson, or rather the ANC chairperson of the Gauteng province. Now, your breaking news at this hour. The ANC in Gauteng has endorsed Cyril Ramaphosa to lead the party and succeed President Jacob Zuma as the president of the party. And uh, as I've just mentioned, uh, all the other nominations that will certainly uh, cross over to uh, the live visuals in Irene. Our reporter, Patricia Vesahi, is there and she'll give us more details about that. For now, though, I'm Simpio Ngoana. Thank you so much for joining us till this far. I hand back to Simon Burke with Sports Live. Goodbye from Johannesburg.